everyone, this is Toadette Girl 20 and welcome to episode 4 of Let's Play Mario Party 4. <laughs> it's the 4th episode and this is Mario Party 4. So let's go ahead and head on into the party cube and see where we're going to go next. I'm excited. Alrighty, here we go. Yahoo! Welcome to party mode. No, we don't need to hear the rolls. It's fine. Yeah. Once again, one player. Yeah. Once again, I'll be Peach and we'll have Mario with me. Okay, for these characters, um, why don't we go, why don't we do the four, you know, why don't we do the four originals? Yeah, the four original characters. Okay. The only playable characters in Mario Party Advance and um, the four the four main characters, basically. Whoops, didn't mean to go that way. We're going to be doing Boo's Haunted Bash. Nice. I love his outfit, by the way. It looks really nice. Choose your settings. Everything's the same. Ten turns, all... The only thing we change is the ten turn. Twenty turns gets turned into ten turns. Hee hee hee, party time. All right, let's head on into Boo's party cube, and... We'll get started here. Alrighty. Welcome to Boo's Sorry, Boo's Haunted Bash. It looks really nice. I like how there's instruments, like ghost forms of instruments. It looks really nice little detail there. I love that. That's basically what his mini game's about. Welcome to Boo's Haunted Bash. It's so good, it's scary. I'll be your ghost or host. <laughs> I love that. This board is a scary little spook house that I cooked up a while back. I wanted to scare everyone who set foot in here. Let's see how you do. Now let's see who gets to go first. E -he -he. Can I be first this time? Oh, I'm third. Our unlucky winner, Yoshi, goes first. Unlucky? Excuse me? Mario is second. Peach is third. Luigi is fourth. At least I ain't last this time. You each start with ten coins. Don't ask. I just felt generous. Oh my god. <laughs> wow. Let's try to do more entertaining stuff. Now happy haunting! Ooh. The first star is going to be right over here. The star is here for now. Hee <laughs> hee. Reach me without 20 coins and you will be denied! said denied in all caps, so I, I just had to, I had to do that. So yeah, there's a lot of boos on this board. We got some red boos as well. They're not called pink boos. They're called red boos. If you didn't know. So yeah, I think this board will be a lot of fun. But what's that thing there? The thing that Mario just passed. I don't know what that is, but it looks interesting. The baby mushroom with its little pacifier. All right, I'm up. Beginning line. Uh, to play it safe, I'm gonna go where they are. I'm gonna go the way they are going for now. Yeah, that'll be fine. Another pink baby mushroom. It has to be Toadette as a baby. I mean, this game came out before Double Dash did. But wouldn't Toad also be the same way? That wouldn't make sense. Alright, our first mini game. Oh, here's a new one. Team Treasure Trek. I think I remember this one. I kind of remember this one. Alright, find the question mark blocks that match your team's color. Once you and your partner have found each block, you must meet each other in the maze. Alright. Move. X, Y, display, hide map. Or Y, X. The two players on the left are the red team, and the two on the right are the blue team. If you get lost, check your map. Alright. I'll, I'll try this. I'll try this. Hopefully I do well. Oh, okay. So they... So... Hopefully I know what I'm doing, and I don't screw up. Alrighty. It's funny how we can see the others. Wow, Mario already found the treasure chest. 
I guess I'm the one finding the key. Okay, mm where's that key? That's a blue one. Okay, that's another blue one. I'm supposed to go with the red one. Hi, Yoshi. Where in the world? Okay, I'm confused. Where's the red where's the red question mark block? This is so confusing. Finish. Oh, they already won. Dang. I did I need to get I need to practice more on these mini games, it seems. So I can get better at them. Especially the ones I struggle with so much. Well, they won. Well, I, I tried. Oh well. Hi everyone. I'm just saying hi to the five hosts. Again, I like that save screen. Sad, sad that Mario Party 6 and 7 didn't do that. They don't have characters on the saving screen. All they have is just the words. That's all they have. Mario Party 5's is pretty interesting too. You'll see that soon. We'll be, we'll be doing that Saturday. So, you might want to be ready for that. Mario using baby Toadette. However, she's missing her pigtails. Oh, okay, what's this? Red boos are very whimsical. Are they now? I like, oh, the, 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 per the candles are purple. Wow. That reminds me of something. Um, when we go camping, um, uh oh, the emulator's well, it's starting to lag a little. I kind of noticed that. So anyways, when we go camping, my cousins sometimes put this, like, thing in our campfire. It, it makes the flames different colors. It's really cool. Next time you guys go camping, you should total I totally recommend you buying one of those things. It'll make your, um, it'll make your campfire, like, colorful. It's really cool. I, I love how she did that. Wonder if she'll do it again this year. Who knows? I don't know. It's her choice. Okay, now the red boo just disappeared. It, it's starting to go slow. You guys can see that. I'm gonna have to deal with it, like I said. I can't control that. I can't control how slow it is. But maybe it'll go fast soon. Whoa, is that a saxophone? What is that? I honestly don't know what that was. Alright, next minigame. Avalanche. Okay, another new one. I'm glad we're getting new minigames here. <clears throat> Alright, what do we do? Don't get swallowed by the avalanche behind you. Ski down the mountain and avoid the obstacles, too. Control stick turn A, use poles for speed. Okay. If you don't use your poles, you'll slow down. Watch out for the walls and boulders and you speed down the when, when you speed as you speed down the hill. Okay, so we just use the control stick and press A. I'm guessing A repeatedly. I would imagine so. I've never been skiing in my life. I don't even want to. Kind of I might I might not be good at it. Okay, I'm pressing A repeatedly, but I'm in the back. That's how you know sometimes emulator games can be hard to play. Oh my god, no! Well, I'm already out. There was no way I was going to win that. Yoshi's got this. I have a feeling he's going to win. Hey, well, he was in the back at first, so you know what they say. Slow and steady wins the race. Like the tortoise and the hare story. <laughs> well, it's true. It that is a good book, by the way. I I I think I've read it before in elementary school. But uh, yeah. I, a thing I remember about school, we were singing this song. There's a hole in the bucket, dear Liza, dear Liza. There's a hole in the bucket, dear Liza. Oh, oh. And fix it, dear Henry, dear Henry. I don't know how it goes, okay. But that is not, we listened to that song in kin- No, I don't think it was kindergarten. It was in elementary school we listened to that song. I don't remember the grade. It was either first, second, around there. But oh my god. Because we read- There were these, like, 
like these books that we would we would always use like they have little stories in them we use those a lot thank you mario now i only have three coins left i'm not mad at you why would i ever be mad at you you're my hero because i'm peach <laughs> Oh, that piano there. That looks pretty interesting. Okay, how is that drum playing by itself? But what is that thing behind Luigi? It looked like a saxophone, but I think it's just a, a handle and a torch. Don't waste your time. Dude. Be nice, boo. I thought Luigi would run away because it's Boo. Luigi's scared of Boo's, isn't he? Luigi's Mansion says it all. Alright, one versus three. So it's going to be a game we played. Fish and Drips. Wait, is this the one I think it is? Where you catch the cheap cheeps? Or wait, that might be a different one. Okay. Oh yeah, we played this one before. Okay, but we lost last time against Yoshi and Yoshi's got our rival again. Can we win this time? Hopefully. Let's find out. Hopefully we can. That would be great. Alright, here we go. The water looks fake. The whole background looks fake. Okay, why? Why? Oh, Yoshi already got his first one done. Oh man, we're filling it up at the same time. Faster, boys. Faster, bros. It's literally me, Mark, and me, Curb, and Mark working together. I love that. It's us three working together. Okay, B, L. Oh my god. Well, we won. Nice. Awesome. We won. Very awesome. All right, not bad. That was great. That was good. We won. Oh, he's going to use his mega mushroom. Not going to lie, that color scheme looks like my friend my my one friend's OC. Except that it, it's not a toadette. It's just a regular mushroom. No glasses and no glasses. Yoshi? Why did you do that? Yoshi! You literally took 10 of my coins and I was four away from the star. Why did you do that? My God! Oh, where's Mario gonna warp to? Oh, Luigi, okay. Okay. I better not get a one. Okay, 10. Better. Um, buy an item? Uh, no thanks. I, I, I don't have enough to buy an item, so what's the point? Yoshi took 10 of my coins away. Luigi, I was going to say, I don't think Luigi's going to use that on me. He, I think he's going to use it on Yoshi because he has the most coins. Yep, I was right. You can't always go for the person first. You have to look how many, if you're stealing coins, you have to look how many coins they have. And if you're stealing stars, look how many stars they have. That's usually how it would work. So don't, so you have to strategize with that. You know what I mean? Keep that in mind. All right, next game. Oh, this game again. Well, like, can I win it this time? Okay, yeah, I already know the controls. We're pretty much good. Yep, same ones. All right, we're good. We got this. 
Yay, it's Bob Bomb again. Yay. Oh, oh yeah. I, wait, I just realized. How did I not notice this till now? I'll explain later. Oh, there's a Bob Bomb. I noticed something about the Bob Bombs in this game. Okay, they're both here. I can easily win this. Come on up. Come on, get him. Yes! Let's go! Nice! So yeah, I noticed something about the bomb bombs. The bomb bombs are missing their wind-up key. I guess bomb bombs didn't have that back then. Interesting. I didn't. I just noticed that. Also, I noticed something else on the results screen. Like the colored background, it looks like it changes depending on what mini game you play. Some of it will be the blue background. Some of it will be the green background. I just kind of noticed that. Dang, boo! Why are you being so disrespectful? Oh, what is that? Oh, I think that, the thing Yoshi just bought, I think it gives you three and three dice blocks instead of two. Ooh, looks like Yoshi's gonna be riding on that thing, nice. How is he riding on a ghost theme thing? Oh, it looks like you get to pick what direction. Oh, he's gonna go where the star is. Well, it looks like Yoshi's gonna get the star. Yep, there he goes. Whoa, two round of miracle, or two miracle spaces next to each other. That's something you don't see every day. Interesting. And Yoshi has two double, double ones there. Oh, actually, make that three miracle spaces. Wow. That's new. Okay, Mario's going to be using his pipe. Yoshi. He's swapping with Yoshi, his ally. Okay, seven. Oh... Head double boost. I love that. What? Wow. Wow. Yeah. Um, for each board, um, the player that's behind the crystal ball, it'll change depending on who the host of the board is. And you've probably already noticed that. So Koopa Seaside, that board, it looks really beautiful. I, can, I gotta say, that might be my favorite board of the game. I cannot wait to play it. It'll be, it'll be tomorrow I'll be playing that. And then the Bowser one won't be until, like, the Bowser board won't be until, like, Friday. Because Wednesday and Thursday are um, tour videos. Okay, now we're the ones riding on it. Nice. However, I noticed something. You see, you see how the star is up ahead of us? I'm one coin short. So I don't think it would be a wise idea to go that way. We are one coin short. There's no way I want to go that way. So I would go that way if I had enough for a star, but sadly I don't because I'm one coin off. So let's just try to get more coins instead of wasting ourselves over there. But it'll be okay. I, okay. I thought I was going to get that item space. Okay, now I have enough for a star. Can I go back? Lol. Mega Mushroom again. Okay. Oh no, please do not. Okay, he didn't do it. All right, mini game. Got another new one. Oh, if it was Mari Medley again, I'd hate that. You know I struggle at that one so much. Okay. This is a coin collecting bonus game. If you run into enemies four times, you're out. We just move with the control stick. Move around while you're falling to get the most coins and avoid all the enemies. So that would be paratroopas and shy guys, right? Or, I think, yeah. 
I remember this minigame. I've seen videos on it, along with the other minigames. Cool how they're riding in an airplane at first. They're skydiving. That's what they're doing. Instead of parachutes, it's balloons. Oh, it's fly guys. Okay, instead of shy guys, it's fly guys. They're flying variant. Oh, come on. Why am I getting hit? Oh, why am I getting hit already? If I get hit one more time, I'm gone. So it better not happen. There's the platform. Look how beautiful the islands look in the distance. Oh, poor Mario. Come on, I want that bag. I want the bag. Oh, I missed it. They both got more coins than I did. Sad. I only got 10. And that's how many you would get in a minigame in total. Just 10 of them. Huh. The last five turns. Ee hee. Only five turns left. Bear witness then to the last five turns event in all its glory. Now let's check our player standings. Oh, that's right. First place, Yoshi. Second place, Mario. Third place, Peach. Dead last, Luigi. Well, don't count on it staying that way because the crowd is full of crafty types. I mean, he, he, anything can happen. Wow, boo. And now it's time for the last five turns, Rowlet, my personal favorite. Here's my lovely assistant, Ihihi Luigi. Your lovely assistant. You don't say. Wow. Ooh, it's a new one. It is decided. Red spaces become fortune spaces. Unbelievable. We're ripe for our an upset. You better hope you've got some seriously good luck. And this ends our last five turns event for the game. Now hang in there, flesh puppets. You're not all bad. Oh my goodness, your dialogue's so funny. Wow. Okay, so I just realized something. If none of the if none of the characters land on the lottery space, if like if they don't get a ticket, like if 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 none of them get a ticket from the lottery place, there won't be a lottery ticket drawing during the last five turns. It'll just go straight to the standings. Yoshi! Dude! You just had to do it again, didn't you? At least I still have enough for a star. I'm literally back where I started last turn. My god, it's like I didn't win the minigame at all. Okay. He's also gonna get a super mega mushroom. By the way, what's that easel with the words? What's that? What, are, what, are, what, what does that say? I don't know. I wonder. All right, I'm up. Hey, is that a trumpet? Uh, let me just see what you have here. This is the item shop. Don't waste my time. Uh, how are we gonna get a magic lamp here? I know that's an item in this game, but I don't see it. How do you get it here? I wonder. Uh, sorry. Then why'd you come in, huh? What a waste of my time. No browsing. Rude. Hello, rude. My god, that booze mean. Wasting. Why are you wasting my time? There's a thing called looking! You can look at the stuff. That's what I was doing. My god, Boo doesn't know how people. Boo doesn't know. Finally, what do you want? My god, Boo. That Boo is disrespectful. All right, next mini game. Do oh, domination. Oh, I remember this one. It's where it's one of those mini games where you press so fast on the controller. Press the switch repeatedly to set up your, to set up your womp dominoes. Yeah, not gonna lie, womps really make really good dominoes. A tap. We have to tap as fast as we can for ten seconds. So yeah, Womps do make really good dominoes. They really do. They look just like them. Alright, here we go. Let's see how I do here. Okay, it looks like I'm going fast. 
Sorry, guys. I'm okay. Alright, here we go. Let's see. Who's gonna win this? Is it me? Wow! Exactly on 80! What? It's not a new record? Huh, strange. Very, very strange. Huh. But that was awesome. We won that. We got our 10 coins back. Nice. Alright. First lottery thing. Well, thing about lottery, it is luck based. It really is. But it never hurts to try. Oh, Bowser. So it could either be Bowser or Koopa Kid. What's it gonna be? Oh, it's just Koopa Kid. I am one of the Koopa Kids. Oh. Uh oh. Oh, Bowser himself is here. You know what that means. Bowser game. So this is the first time we're gonna be seeing a, you're gonna be seeing a Bowser game in, in a video. So, so there's three games in total, and all three of them are like luck based, kind of. Yeah, pretty much. So it is kind of challenging. So keep that in mind. Wahaha, welcome. Well, this time the Bowser game is. Which one is it? Fruits of Doom. Ooh, okay, this one isn't that bad. You just have to memorize fruits. Want to hear the rules? Uh, yeah, sure. Uh, yeah? There we go. All right, listen up, weaklings. I'm going to explain the rules of this game. So no snoozing. <laughs> Master Bowser will say which fruit he wants to eat. He's very particular. Then you guys must find the right fruit and bring it to him. And don't mess up. Stand in front of the fruit and press A to grab it. Yes, press A, you simpletons. If you bring a fruit that Master Bowser didn't ask for, or if you bring more than the number he asked for, more than the number he asked for, I love this part, then things might get a wee bit warmer for you. Yeah, like a London broil. Oh my god. Now let's get started. That Koopa Kid right there is fanning him. I'm so very hungry. You, weaklings, bring fruit to sash satiate the mighty Koopa King. You're not a Koop. You're not the mighty Koopa King. What refreshing flavor do I... Okay, here's where... Okay, cherry, strawberry, cherry, pineapple. Yes, it goes really fast. But if you were to play this game in slow motion, it wouldn't go fast. You could win easily, but I highly don't recommend that. All right, let's see what Yoshi's up to. Oh my god, I just realized Yoshi loves fruit. Yoshi, you know what Yoshi would have done instead? I bet Yoshi would eat all the fruit himself, and he would be immediately burned by Bowser if that happened. So don't do that, Yoshi. I know you love fruit, but it's Bowser's turn to eat the fruit instead of you. Because Yoshi loves fruit. I know he does. Mario, I think Mario likes, I think Mario loves fruit too, because in Super Mario Sunshine, he was like in love with it. He made hard eyes seeing it. Delish. Okay, I saw cherries on there, so we're going to go with the cherries. I saw cherry, I saw strawberry, and I saw pineapple. There were two cherries on there. Oh, by the way, they do not have to be in order from the list that he said, as long as you get all of them. So also another thing to keep in mind. There will be a loser at some point. There is not gonna. There's no. There's no way everybody can survive this. There will be a loser at some point. Because. Because um, if you like, if you're the one giving him the eleventh fruit instead of the ten fruit, you're automatically out. Because uh, there has to be a loser at some point in this game. So if if all the fruits were picked, and you're giving him like an extra fruit, you're automatically the loser. So keep that in mind. Okay, Yoshi's giving up him another grape. Oh! 
Yoshi, uh, Yo Yoshi lost. Oh, look at him, guys. He's literally black Yoshi now. Except that, except that he doesn't have the white on his sides and he doesn't have the white chest. Ah, and Yoshi was, and Yoshi was the one that landed on his face. Oh my goodness. Okay, so yeah. The other two Bowser games are Darts of Doom and Balloons of Doom. I don't know if we're going to be seeing them again on video. It, it, it's kind of rare, kind of, to land to get him to be there, but I don't know. So basically, in Darts of Doom, it's a dartboard game. However, it's not your typical game of dartboard, because here's what happens. Usually in darts, when you play darts, usually you would want to hit the bullseye. But however, in Darts of Doom, since it's a Bowser minigame, you cannot hit you cannot hit the bullseye because then you're out. You have to avoid the bullseye. And before I explain the next one, Mario just landed on um, the round of miracles. And so this is just like chance time, basically. And it, we're finally getting this in a video. Nice. So I like how it's based on pinball, and I've played pinball before. Okay, it's Luigi, so we're pretty good there. Alright, not bad. Okay, what's he gonna get this time? Oh my god, it almost chose me! Oh no. Okay, what are Luigi and Yoshi doing? I would read the dialogue, but uh, he's going fast. Alright, let's see what they're doing. Oh, oh boy. Oh, they're trading coins! Oh, wow. Okay. And I love how each of the hosts do this instead of just the one from the board. I love that. There now there's all five hosts, all of them. Okay. So that's basically around of miracles. And since they replaced all the red spaces, we'll be seeing a lot more round of miracle spaces. Oh my god, again? <laughs> Wow! It's happening again! We just got this last... We just got this, though! Why are we doing this again? Wow. In the special event, Verse Fortune, right? Well, then our last place player needs... So, are we all ready? Yeah. Okay, in the game, we decide who gives what to whom. All right, then. I love the designs in the middle of it too, how it's showing all the hosts on there. I love that. Okay. So let, that's how you basically. Okay, it's Luigi again. Yeah, this one you have to watch out for the Koopa Kids. I don't know how the Koopa Kids got in there, but that's weird. Okay. Okay, it's Mario. Okay. So now we find out what they're doing. And there's the ho me with the host of the board. I love this trickery stuff. Keep an eye on the... Okay, I should have done that. So now there's three Koopa Kids. Oh my god. What are we doing? Oh, oh! Stars and coins. Oh boy. Oh, they don't have any stars though, so it's just gonna be the coins then. They're trading coins. Just trading coins. Aw, oh, Mario, I'm sorry. It's okay, though. I'm sure you can get more. You'll get more coins soon. Okay, he's using his, uh, he's using his Mega Mushroom. Oh boy. Seven. Okay. What is a chair doing there? <laughs> are the are the boos gonna like use them or something? Probably. Oh, this is the mini game where you catch cheap sheeps. I struggled last time because I was going too fast. So you're not supposed to go fast. Okay, so hopefully this time I can go slower, and then maybe I'll be able to catch the cheap sheeps. Who knows? Let's just hope. 
I hope. I just hope. And yes, guys, I have played this game on the actual GameCube before. I played a lot of... I, I, I like I like played almost every Mario game on the GameCube, I think. We, we had, like, almost every Mario game. I think the only games we didn't have were, like... Okay, <gasps> finally! I caught a cheap cheap! Let's go! Finally! It worked! Yes, I got another one! And it's good because I'm getting the yellow ones. I got two at the same time! I'm doing way better than last time we played this game. What do you know? Oh my god, come on, get back here. Uh oh, they, they're, they might catch up to us. Come on, Mario, we got this. Okay, there's a yellow one there, let's try to get that. Oh, come on, I ha almost had it. Oh, no. It doesn't matter, we still won. We finally won this time, let's go. GG's. Love, lovely. That was good. Last three turns. So we're on the last three turns. I just realized a lot of stuff are happening on this board. So maybe the video might be longer. But it's okay. Sorry about that. Oh, I think you can only use it when Red Boo's not in sight. Oh, a battle space. Wonder why the bob don't have their keys. That's what I wonder. Their wind-up keys. Because I guess it's an early design. Uh, oh, this one again. Okay. Okay, we we played this before and we won last time, so... I think we can do it. This minigame is... I don't think this minigame is that hard. Just have to know what you're doing. You have to pay attention, so... Pretty much, yeah. Oh, God. Oh, no. So, yeah, you just... Ha oh, my God. It's Why is it Why is it going towards me, though? Seriously, it keeps going in the direction I'm going in. That's weird. Okay, this that time it didn't go the way I was going. Oh no. Oh, it moved so quickly. Oh no. Oh no, oh my god, oh my god. Oh no, oh my god. It's, wow, we won again. What do you know? I think I think when I was young, I think when I played this game when I was young, I think I lost a lot because I didn't know the controls a lot well back then, but I know them a lot now. How many coins did I get? 25. Nice. Okay. Okay, that time the third place player got a coin and the fourth place player doesn't. And sometimes it can be the other way around. Where the fourth place player gets something and, and the third place player doesn't. Okay, um, let me, let me see this. Since I can't use the other thing, it doesn't work for some reason. I don't know why. Um, where's the... Okay, the star space is right there. Oh. Okay. Okay. Two versus two. Oh, it better... N I, I was gonna say, it better not be right or left. That one's stupid. So we're playing Great Deflate. Okay. So basically, um, I'm Luigi's partner, and Luigi's about to get the star, and he's like a couple coins off. So if me and Luigi win this game, that means he's going to get the star next turn. So that doesn't matter. I'm going to try to get minigame star anyway, so. So yeah, if you jump at the same time, it'll go faster, so keep that in mind. I love the beach setting. I love it. 
with the realistic sky. Very nice. There we go. Yep, we won. That means the star's all Luigi's. Well, we, it, uh, I'm hoping we can get the star again soon. Okay, he's gonna use his Mega Mushroom. I better not be in his way, so he doesn't steal my coins yet again. Oh, I better not be there. I better not be there where he's at. Okay, thank God. Okay, Mario's doing the lottery shop again. So, yeah, they're, they're just, they're, there's only like two different games you can play for this thing. Ah, oh, good try. How do you win? How do you win? You're not playing. Wow, Boo straight up over here saying that he won, yet he's not even playing. Wow. Weird, but okay. Is that a piano that I see? Another battle minigame space. Okay. This video might be the longest out of all of them, but because of all, all the stuff that's happening. No, we are not playing Bowser's Big Blast. It's terrible. No way. Catch the butterfly. Oh yeah, our, wait, we played this before. I don't need to read the rules. Yeah, so I'm gonna go with the swiping sideways technique to make it like, you know, to make it like easier and everything. So I don't know how we're gonna do this time, but let's find out. I just love the I just love the way this looks. Love it. Flower the flower field really looks nice. I wanna know how okay, I wanna know how the characters got over there without messing up any of the flowers. I wonder how they did that. Again, Mario logic. Anything can happen. Yeah, I'm gonna go with the I'm gonna go with the sideways technique. I think to me, I personally, I think it's like the easiest. So yeah, I'm gonna go with that. Okay, got those. Hey, this game, this game's cool. They give you a lot of time, though. That's kind of what I realized about it. Can I get a couple more, maybe? Wow, I got one right at the end there. Nice. Okay. Alright, let's see. How do the butterflies end up in there, though? Because we get them from the net. That's just... How did Mario and Yoshi tie? Wow. They tied. How'd that happen? So they both got their... Wow, Mario gets a coin, but Yoshi does. Oh, that's just... Oh, poor Yoshi. If that were me in that situation, I would not be happy about that. It's just one coin. What's one coin gonna do? I'm not... Actually, I wouldn't be upset. It's just one coin. But if it were more than that, then yeah, I probably would be upset. Oh, what up, Red Boo? Ooh, looks like Luigi is gonna be doing the piano. Ooh, this looks nice. I think you can only you can only play this when you're mini sized. Because the pianos are keys are small. This looks fun. I wish I could play this. So, you have to jump on the correct keys, I guess. 
Maybe we'll hear something. So I'll stay silent. Nice. Very nice. Very nice. That was nice. So it didn't sound beautiful. It sounded bootyful. <laughs> Get it? Because there's boos here. Bootyful. Ooh, three throw. Ooh, three throw is a good mini game. I, I like this mini game. It's one of my favorites. Try to make the most shots into the moving baskets. A jump, B shoot. The middle baskets are worth two points. The bottom worth one point. And shoot after the high. Oh, oh my God! Can I read? Yes, I can. So let's make some baskets. This wasn't in Superstars, but it is in Top Hundred. Okay, here we go. Let's see how we do here. Oh, I'm so good at this. Except when it bounces off when there's a basket already full and you have to try to put it in another one. You guys, you know, guys, I feel like giving Wii Party a time. Uh, I feel like giving Wii Party a try at some point. It's similar to Mario Party, but instead of uh, instead of uh, Mario characters, it's me characters. And I think you can use any me character you want. I feel like that's what it would do. I would love to try out Wii Party. I would love to try that game out. Because if you can choose whatever me characters you want, you know what me is I'm choosing? Toadette team. Because why not? It'd be nice. It would be really nice. I want to try that game out sometime. I will try that out. I will. But how would the mini games, um, how would some of the mini games work where you have to shake the Wii remote and you're, but it's, it's an emulator. So how would that work? I, I really don't know. Maybe the, maybe, maybe Dolphin has a technique that makes you like, make, let, that would work where it's like you're, uh, it'll like, it'll work as a Wii remote. It'll like work easier. I don't know. I'll have to find out. Okay. Also, I just realized some... Well, actually... Yeah, for some of the mini-games where you have to shake the Wii remote, how would that work? And Yoshi once again got a Bowser space. But it's Koopa Kid again. Wow, you actually gave him coins. Yeah, that's usually what would happen. Oh my god, how many battle spaces are we gonna get? Three turns in a row. Oh my god. Wow. I was gonna say, it better not be 50 coins. Wow. Oh, come on! Well, prepare for me to get out first, because it happened last time. Why did it have to be this one? Stop. Well, I'm probably gonna get out first, because it already, like, it already happened. Yep, I told you. I told you. It happened again. Yep, got out first, yet again. <laughs> well, we're pretty much... Pretty much just screwed at this point. This minigame's just so unfair. I swear, it is. Up, oh, Luigi got out. All right, let's see how they do. Yeah. 
Can't, so the new tour is going to be called the Winter Tour. And it uh, looks pretty interesting. Have we ever had a, another Winter mm. Tour before? I'm going to have to check. Oh, Mario wins. Good job, Mario. Good job. We're, a lot of stuff are happening. So I have a feeling this might be the longest Mario Party video. For Mario Party 4, at least. What if it reaches one hour? Can you imagine? I don't know if it's going to. Okay, three coins. Alrighty. One versus three. And yes, I, th I believe this is this was the last turn, so uh, we're playing go yet again. I love how it's called go. I love that. Do this, my friend. Let's do this, guys. Oh, come on. Dang, Yoshi's doing good. He's like blocking the shots easily. And it shows each of the three on the Jumbotron right there. Why does it look like that? Shouldn't it like be a clear, a clear Jumbotron instead of like little squares like that? Oh, dang. Wow, we were so close, but we lost. Oh, oh well. Look at that big Yoshi on the Jumbotron. <laughs> oh well, we tried. And yep, I believe that was the last turn. Yep, it was, I remember. All right, well that's, the, that's Boo's Haunted Bash. Awesome. Not bad, mortals, and here come the results. First, let's see the number of stars. Here's everyone's number of stars. Yep, Yoshi got the most there. Next, let's see the number of coins. Everyone's number of coins is. Yep, I automatically get the coin star. Now it's time for the bonus of results. Each chosen player will receive one star. First, the minigame star. This is the person who got the most coins in minigames. So the minigame star is... <gasps> Me! Let's go! If I win by bonus stars again, then... Wow. Okay, uh, coin star, that's me. Don't tell me I just won this again with bonus stars. Oh my freaking god. I don't think anybody landed on a happening space. It's literally the same as Toad's Midway Madness at this point. If I think I won again, guys. I think I won again. Oh my god. Oh my god! What, 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 what? I, I, I'm, I'm speechless. I won again. Bye, 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 bonus stars. Oh my god. Oh my god, oh my god, oh my god, oh my god, oh my god. Wow. Holy mackerel. Okay, well. Wow, would you look at that? We are the superstars yet again. So here are the results. One miracle, two miracle spaces, two Bowser spaces. Wow, I was the only one to not get two item spaces. What do you know? Alrighty, well that's gonna be it for this video. Or this episode. That was a lot of fun. Alright everybody. This is Toadette Girl 20 Thank you all so much for watching. Next episode, we are going to go on to Koopa Troopa's board. That'll be tomorrow. This is Toadette Girl 20 Thanks for watching, and see you guys later.